Hi, I'm Two-Face. Because I have two faces. We are fighting. I'm so mad because Two-Face borrowed my toy to play with and he broke it. Now I don't have any favorite toy. Wait, 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 wait. Did you say toys? Does that mean toys also play with other toys? Uh, yes. Yes, that's right. I do have toys. Interesting. So anyway, I'm mad! I did not mean to break your toy, Kelsa. Yes, that's right, Kelsa. I tried to be careful, but I will... Well, accidents happen, and it broke. I don't have enough money to buy you a new toy. I'm sorry. Well, I can't forgive you, because you shouldn't have done that. You should have been more careful, and I cannot forgive you. I'm mad. Swooping in hot. I can see you are fighting. Actually, I could hear you are fighting way up in the sky. I think I have just the Bible story for you. Jesus talked about this very thing. Jesus talked about his friend rudely breaking his toy and not forgiving him? Uh, sort of. Yeah, you'll see. A long time ago, Jesus told his disciples a parable. Uh, what's a parable? A parable is a story that Jesus made up to teach people an important lesson. Oh, cool, like books. I love to read books. Yes, kind of. So one day, a long time ago... Hi, I'm Peter. I'm not made up. I really existed. Jesus, I have a question for you. What's up, Peter? How many times should I forget someone? Like seven times or so? Oh, no. You should forgive 70 times 7. In other words, you should never stop forgiving. Let me give you an example. It's kind of like this. There was this dude who owed the king millions of dollars. Hey, I am the king. You owe me millions of dollars. Pay up. Um, I cannot pay that. Fine then, I will sell you and your family. Off you go. No, please have mercy on me. I don't have money. Oh, please, please. Okay, matey, I will take away your debt and I will forgive you. You may go. Hooray! Goodbye. Hey, you! You owe me thousands of dollars. Pay up now. Please forgive me. Please forgive me. I do not have enough money. Give me more time, sir. No! Take him to jail. Don't let him go until he pays me back. You will go to jail to infinity and beyond. That's terrible. <sighs> How rude is that? He was forgiven? but then wouldn't forgive anyone else? Exactly. Hey, you. I heard you didn't forgive that guy when I just forgave you millions of dollars. You owed me. That is very, very bad. Away you go. Boy, that guy was terrible. I can't believe he didn't forgive him when he was forgiven so much. Exactly. Let me ask you something, Kelsa. Have you ever made a mistake? Yeah, I guess so. And Jesus has forgiven you much and took away all your sins when he died on the cross for your sins and raised from the dead. Remember Easter? Oh, no. So I'm like the guy in Jesus' parable? Um, yes, you are. It's like the verse in the Bible in Colossians 3.13. Remember, the Lord forgave you, so you must forgive others. Colossians 3.13. Remember, the Lord forgave you. So you must forgive others. Two-Face, I'm so sorry. I should have forgiven you because Jesus forgave me everything I've ever done. I forgive you for breaking my toy, Two-Face. I'm sorry. That was very uncool of me. Thank you so much, Kelsa. And I forgive you for not forgiving me. Goodbye. And why does this matter? Because your story is a part of God's big story. Make sure to subscribe. Thirsty out.